Welcome on-site wastewater community. I'm here with Steve Miller and my name is Rob May. We're both with a company called Reovation and we're here to tell you about a remarkable product. It's the Reovation BioMaze 2624. Steve, can you tell us about it? Thank you, Rob. Yeah, so the BioMaze product is a, a fixed film media product that converts any state approved one or two compartment septic tank to a biofilm reactor. And so the way that works is we're using a fixed film media. It's in the form of pods. These pods are uh, floating. They have floats. We have the media and they drop into the tank and they self position. Do it at the discharge or the outlet end of the tank. And these pods are media pods out here. These pods are uh, fine air diffusion pods. It's the same media pod with uh, fine air diffusion in the form of ceramic diffusers uh, that, that are proprietary. And they create a, a tremendous amount of oxygen within the tank because of the fine air, the nature of the fine air. So the pods get lowered in, they self position. Then we have an air pump housing with a visual and audible alarm. That uh, alarm package is uh, mounted to the inside of the lid. And then we have the uh, XP80, the 80 liter high blow pump. It's uh, drawing less than one amp, very efficient, and pr produces a tremendous amount of air with the diffusers that we're using. So this uh, housing can go over near the house or an outbuilding or anywhere you have power. Uh, if you already have an outlet nearby, up to 75 feet from the, the riser. Then you three quarter PVC pipe between there, connect a female adapter to the, uh, the barb fitting, and then you penetrate the riser. If you're using uh, two of these typically uh, on most installations, you put a, a, a T assembly, create a little manifold with female adapters on it, and then hook up the barb fitting on that end. And, and you're pretty well done. If uh, all you need is a riser, if you don't already have one installed. Uh, so that's an easy installation. The reason this is so productive, Rob, I'm gonna move over. The reason this is so productive is we're creating a, a, a biofilm reactor that's making single digit CBOD5 and TSS water typically within one compartment of the tank or within a single compartment tank. It's the, the entire tank is clear and odorless and we don't require a clarifier because we have media we have media for the microbes to, to occupy, they're not in suspension. So what that does is if you've got a, a failure because of biomat, the oxygen rich water kills the microbes that are causing the problem, the anaerobic microbes, and the, the microbes that are pushed out with it, the aerobic microbes that are pushed out uh, in small amounts that, that there may be some in the water, they're gonna consume the biomat that's causing the problem and clear up the drain field often in, in weeks or just a couple of months. Now, if you've got a drain field that's so impacted that they can't even flush, it's surfacing or backing up into the house, uh, typically your solution is to, to, to dig up the yard, put a new drain field in. That's a good option if, if that's the only option, but we're finding great success using our filter pump vault. So the filter pump vault hangs from inside the same riser you still have room to, to, to service it and, and care for it, pump it. It just hangs from inside the riser. It's a mini pump vault. It hangs to the, uh, the bottom of the outlet pipe level. And we have hubs. So you cut off the uh, T-assembly and clean, clean up the uh, inside of the discharge pipe, the outlet pipe. And now you have an SDR-26, SDR-35, or Schedule 40 hub that slides in and now you can connect up the flex hose with the three quarter or the three inch PVC spigot and it can connect to any of those uh, uh, outlets now. So you immediately have a level control inside the tank to within three quarter inch of the bottom of the outlet. So the homeowner can continue to use the, 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 the home, they can flush the toilet, use the sink and, and the tank level will be maintained the biomaze will be cleaning up the water, pushing it out to the drain field and cleaning up the drain field in very short order. Uh, we're finding great success with that. We always recommend using the, the, uh, the pedestal alarm with it. You have a high level alarm that goes with the package. 
So now you, uh, you have high level alarm and uh, all your electrical components are uh, connected inside this um, uh, alarm package. There's no electrical connections with inside the tank. Everything is secure, vapor tight away from the tank uh, in, a, in a nice, clean, dry environment. So that's the, the two package products. So uh, we'll give it back to Rob. He's going to talk a little more to us. Thanks very much, Steve, for explaining that to us. Uh, we also don't want to forget what we've done for the installers. When you purchase your uh, first uh, unit or uh, package, uh, we have these signs, they're yard signs. Uh, the only way that people will understand what's actually happening is if you put a sign up because it's all happening in the tank or in the drain field uh, without excavation. So we figured this would actually help the contractor uh, to advertise a little bit for themselves. Yeah, we yeah, we, we'll print the contractor's name and contact information here at the bottom. And we ship five of those signs with your first order as a professional installer. So there you go. So, uh, Steve, thank you very much for explaining that to us. And uh, we had the opportunity to uh, attend and actually exhibit at the uh, NAURA 2022 Mega Conference. That's the National On-Site Wastewater Recycling Association 22, uh, 2022 Mega Conference in Missouri. And at the conference, uh, we talked to one of our installers. Uh, his name's Tony Berry. He's been using this product and loves it, has had great success for it. So we're going to clip in uh, to that uh, interview right now. Yeah, and also, Rob, we just want to say thank you to uh, NAURA and, and Missouri Small Flows. Uh, tremendous show, and, and we appreciate all this, the, the great program, the great success we had with the program. Thank you. Hey, good morning, Tony. It's really nice to have you here at the NAURA Mega Conference 2022, and we appreciate you taking a few minutes with us. Just wanted to ask you a couple of questions about our Biomaze product. So first of all, how long have you been in the on-site water industry? Since 1978. Wow, that's a good, good long time. So you've seen a lot of things. Now, uh, Tony, uh, how did you get introduced to the Biomaze product? Well, we were having a trouble uh, problem with the system, and the uh, engineer came up with it. And uh, I called, check it out, see what was going, what, what we needed to do. When I first saw it, I didn't believe it was going to work, but uh, we put it in and uh, had good results with it ever since. Well, that's great. That's awesome. So how many uh, installations have you done so far and what are your results been? I have four of them and every one of them are working fine. I mean, they, they working very well. So uh, did they clear up the uh, drain fields? One of them uh, where we put this uh, pump um, uh, in, it, uh, we had surfacing water and the drain field, uh, we didn't have to do any digging or anything. It's it, it working fine. That's awesome. So you just dropped it in, didn't have to dig any of the drain fields up and they're working. At all. We didn't even know where the drain field was until we saw the, the wet spots. And uh, it started uh, clearing it up. That's awesome. How long would you say it took to clear it up? A little over a month. That's fantastic. And uh, let me ask you this. Um, what's the last thing we want to talk to you about? You've talked about the filter pump vault. So that's great. Well, I think that's it, Tony. We really appreciate your time. Thanks so much. Thank you.